As Uganda prepares to celebrate the African Traditional Medicines Day at the end of the month, the National Drug Authority NDA has gone to organize a series of workshops in the Ankole region to create awareness on the use of herbal medicine and counterfeits on the market. According to Haji Jamiro Lutakome from Uganda Herbalist Association, they have been lacking a legal framework to guide the practice and also the issue of imposters in the profession. Lacking a legal framework to guide the practice has been a very big challenge. And two, there are so many people who have come into the sector uh, having the knowledge of, uh, of charging money, uh, consulting things, things of that kind. So, but we want to ensure that uh, those people who have been doing it should, should stop. According to the National Drug Authority, this move is geared towards improving service delivery, especially among the herbalists. There are some with some good uh, medicine, but packaging is very poor, hygiene is very poor. And you talked about also hiding information, it's also very important. So when you, we assure them through the law that there is no problem. The National Drug Authority says that it will continue with this investigation after the training and also back some of the places where the herbal medicines are manufactured. We are going to go ahead and visit the manufacturing premises so that we can further provide them capacity building to see how best their premises can be improved and how the quality of the products they are going to, to manufacture is better uh, enhanced. This is from buying medicines from hawkers, uh, as NDA cannot confirm the quality and safety of those medicines. We encourage them to buy medicines from NDA licensed premises. According to a report by the Public Partnership for Health, over 60% of Ugandans rely on herbal medicine. Bashir Omar, CTV, PM Edition.